How you going? My name is Brendan and today we are going to be building the biggest dock in Valheim. That was a super dramatic like explanation, but I mean, it's, it's, it, yeah, it's dramatic to me, <laughs> but it's going to be a big one. It's going to be a big one because as you can see, I have all my boats parked out here. The Drakkar does not fit in my little natural harbor here, which is a bit of a problem. The other two do, but the Drakkar doesn't. So I'm going to be building a dock that will take all three of the boats. I'm not doing the raft because honestly, what's the point? Now I have done a pretty cool dock before. Which is this one, which is honestly my, 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 my crowning glory. It's like my pride and joy, this dock. So I need to try and one up this. Now this long ship was able to be roofed. So my goal is to make sure that all three of my ships will be roofed. Now, of course, you guys will have seen it at the very beginning, like what the actual end looks like, which is cool. If that's all you guys want to see and you're all done, no worries. Um, but I'm still going to do a build so that for those of you who do want to watch it can actually see what goes into it and how insane I go. Now we are doing the full playthrough of Ashlands. We are approaching the end. It's not too far until, sorry, I'm just playing the balls. Uh, it's not too far until we finish this game because we have the Ashlands boss just around the corner. But before I do that, I want to make sure that I'm, you know, fully geared, all that kind of stuff. But also there's this island that needs to like finish being built. I'll show you what I mean. Now over here, I have my castle with this lovely little bridge that leads out to it. Castle's awesome. That got raised up out of the small little ground spot that was there. If you haven't seen it, there's videos for all these builds that we've done. The massive portal hub that we have here, which evidently isn't big enough now. The tavern that we built. Oh, I don't have the feather cape. Whoops. Uh, good thing I have HP. Uh, the lighthouse. Uh, additionally, the stone circle. The, I don't know what you want, really, Viking stone circle, I think is what I called it. Um, yeah, we'll go with the Viking stone circle. Additionally, there is also the massive farm that's over there as well. See, that's not just a wall. That is ground that's been completely raised up because there is a farm inside that. Now, there's still this section here that I want to do, which is the dock. I want to do a smithing section back here for higher levels of production so I can kind of, you know, mass produce things. I'll probably do another portal hub over here just for the stone portals because there won't be that many. I'll do a smithy blacksmith on the other side of this. I want to do a really cool fish pond because there's a pond on the other side. If you have been watching these videos, you'll know that there's a little pond over there that I want to expand and actually turn that into a fish pond. Uh, additionally, I'd like to make a mage tower, a trophy room, and then an armor, you know, armor room. And then that's the island kind of finished. Like, that's all the builds that I want to do in the island. So, I know you guys enjoy my, my building videos, or, or, or at least some of you do, based on the comments. So, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a series of builds. We're just going to smash out all these builds. And then once the build is done, we're going to go and finish this boss. We're going to finish Ashlands finally. And this playthrough will be done. That doesn't mean the end for Valheim videos. I have some things planned. I have some challenges, some ideas, some videos that I think you will all find very interesting and entertaining. Additionally, I have some project builds that I'm going to be doing some, some big proper build videos, not like these playthrough build videos that I do like actual proper build videos, but all will still be in survival. I ain't doing any of that creative mode stuff. Everyone does creative mode more impressive when it's survival because it means that you guys can do the builds as well if i can you guys can so without further ado I'm just, you know stop blabbering my mouth what i need to do is shape this pond a bit because it needs to fit all three of the boats i'm thinking the drakkar will go long ways down there by the way i have no idea how this is going to look or if it's even going to work to be honest so drakkar is going to go long ways and then i'm going to have the long boat and the carve off to the side so I'm going to need to do some reshaping here, which is going to be incredibly boring. So I'm just going to skip ahead to when that's done 
and when I start laying out the outline of the actual dock. Yay for me. Yay for you guys. I need to go grab a cart so I don't drown. Well, it's taking a little bit of time, but I've managed to shape out the actual, you know, section. It's a pain having to use the cart and kind of like balance perfectly so that I can actually hit the ground to make it a little bit deeper so that the car can come in and out. We only need to make a channel for it, so it's fine. But this is more or less kind of the shape that I'm thinking. So the Drakkar will go there. Longship, longship and Carve will come in here. And then there'll actually be like an actual dock around it and there's going to be some more stuff here. But that's for next time. Anyway, I have put down a Ashland stone portal so that I can teleport resources back and forth. Uh, and now I can actually start with the build itself. And I'm going to make it all out of grass. Because why not? So, the first placement's like are real important on, on, on where I want it to be. That's going to kind of dictate the neatness of everything. Should be good. Or on either side. Yep. Now... There you go. All right, cool. So that's kind of kind of be the, like that's how wide it's going to be. I actually, I don't know if I'm going to be able to roof this. I'm, I'm really hoping that I can. You guys will know if I can, because you will have seen it in the, uh, at the beginning of the video when I pop it up. I have no idea if I'm actually going to roof this. So I'm hoping I can, but I'm going to keep uh, stretching this out. I might need to raise the ground in certain spots. Probably. Yeah, I think I'm going to. Yep. All right, cool. So I'll raise the ground in certain spots just to make it so that it's strong enough. But this will extend all the way out to here. Same on the other side. And then I'll extend it all around the outside as well. Basically do the outline of where everything is so I know where it needs to go. And then I'll need to dig in the actual spots where the carve and longship will park. And then I'll be able to do the roofs. The roofs are the satisfying part, like... Honestly, it's like the most satisfying part out of all of this. All right, cool. I'm going to continue with this. Look, it's a tedious life being me and doing my builds but ah it's all right the grinding can be pretty uh pretty full on because i grind everything i do the, like everything in survival mode i don't do it, do it in creative mode which is why i have the portal so i can portal back and forth and get the resources i know a lot of people are like do i have any mods as well nope um i might do like a modded playthrough later on like after i've done this one but this world is completely vanilla no mods whatsoever it's just a standard playthrough so everything that i do in this uh you can do it as well in you know a normal playthrough as well without any mods which is the idea of this like i didn't want to do a creative world i didn't want to do a mod modded world or anything like that because then i'm doing stuff that a lot of people can't do so yeah making it more fun that way I think alright there we go out of grass and level that alright cool I will go and get some more grass and uh, and stone and stuff like that because I need to level certain spots and we will continue this because this is going to extend the whole way All right, we now have a lovely, lovely dock. Yeah, Grassen is seriously satisfying to work with. Just that like smooth finish along the side and then like these nice square, oh, just satisfying that OCD. This with a roof, oh, no, three roofs. Oh, it's gonna be good. 
All right. First things first is going to be the carve. And that's mostly because... Well, it's smaller. So it's going to be easier to uh, do. I don't actually know. I'm pretty sure it would just be one square, but... I need to uh I need to check so get in now also the reason I raised every everything as well is so that things can't actually get up to it so on the outside it's like three high I think so you know deers can't get in great dwarves can't wander in all that kind of stuff helps make the boats a bit more safer so I don't know. In my head, that seemed like a good idea. Uh, let's back her up. Do, 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 do. Uh oh. I mean, it, I'll, I'll be able to fit everything. It's just a bit. It's just a bit tight, you know. Okay. All right. So, one, two. Three. Nope. There we go. Yeah, two wide is definitely enough. Okay, two wide and then probably three deep. I think. Should do it. Oh, I didn't want to do that. God, this boat is slow. Yay. Please tell me. Oh, yeah, it fits. Whoop. Okay. That is two down. We've got the Dracarian. We've got the Carvin. And now we just need to do the longboat. Fortunately, I already did one over in the plains, which you would have seen at the beginning. So I'm just going to go over and get the measurement. I'm just going to go over there and get the measurements from that. Then I know how big of a space I need. Oh, right, I got a portal. One into the portal. I also realized that I could have just used that for the long boat, but look, man, don't judge me. <laughs> All right, this one's a little bit tighter than the other one, just because. Uh... Yeah. Just because I'm gonna have to shuffle it a smidge forward. There you go. Uh, just because I like it's not a huge amount of space that we have, and I didn't want to kind of like utilize everything. So I'll probably integrate like a step solution up to the boats, but I'll do that later. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna get the roof sorted uh, for all three of them. So carve longboat and dracar and everything fits like pretty good. I'm hoping that I can get a roof over the Drakkar because that is, yeah, it's a pretty big boat. I'll be able to do something like worst case scenario, I can raise the ground, but what I'll probably do, yeah, is raise, sorry, use iron beams because it'll be a lot stronger and have, I have it so much iron. It's not funny. So use iron beams to get the height and then like the actual structure to it and then use, um, Darkwood poles on the outside of the iron beam, and then that will kind of hide it. I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll go grab some iron beam. I'll show you what I'm. I'll show, I'll show, I'll show you what I'm going to do for that. Cause it'll uh, it'll look a lot better, I reckon. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so basically, <clears throat> when I do one of these dock harbors, if you want to go for like maximum strength. It's a little bit of iron, like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, like 6. It's about 60-ish iron right here. So like two full stacks. Um, but if you have a problem like me where, you know, you will spend hours upon hours upon hours grinding, uh, it's not really that bad. But something like this is only 60. And literally what, 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 like what we're doing here, you can scale it up for the longboat. And then what I'm hoping is that you can also do the same thing for the Drakkar. So basically, uh, 
Uh, I'll do it on one of the cross beams, but you can see so you can you can place the actual dark wood over it. And then it doesn't even look like you have iron there. It just looks like you have a dark wood dock. So it's just a little handy little way that you can kind of make it look a bit prettier. I don't know if the devs actually did this by design. If they did. Hats off, because it's a uh, hundred percent a good way of doing it. Because it looks, it makes things like look way cooler. How much that? Yeah, it makes it look way cooler being able to place things over it. Like for example, that there, like that segment there, just looks like it's dark wood. And then when you put the tar roof on. Looks good. Looks real, real nice. And I have some plans for the actual decoration. I like. It's a little bit of a different take on uh, how I'm going to do the dock this time, like the the harbor. Especially considering it's like a. This is more of a harbor. It's not really like a dock because it's like multiple ships. But I got a little bit of a different idea on how I'm going to decorate it. Actually, I'm going to go sleep. Because it's getting night time and I want to be able to see. But it's coming along. Ah, uh, so we have everything in place. <clears throat> but I have a plan, an idea. I don't know if it's going to work. I'm hoping it does. Because it'll, it'll be pretty cool if it does. But basically... Yeah, it's sick. Yeah. Yeah. I'm I'm an into, I, I'm I'm an architect, right? Like Look at this. This is made an arch. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. And then what I will do now. Bit of bit of this fancy stuff here. Yeah, uh-huh. Uh-huh. And then Oh. Oh. Tell me that is not like a sick design. Looks that looks mad. All right. I'm going to do the same thing on this side. I'll do the same thing on that side and then I'll figure something out for the back here cuz I want to I kind of want to do something to like fill in the back a bit. That looks mad though. Now that I've like un unlocked all these, all these, um, these materials, I like some of you guys are commenting like in my way older videos being like, oh, just like, you know, progress the story more. Cause you're going to unlock so many, like so many better materials. Like if I had Grouston, I would have made like an even cooler farm. Like, you know, even cooler B platform. The lighthouse would have been like completely different. The tavern would have been different. Hell the castle would have been different but i like the way that it is all, like all, all of that is now it's fine but this is like this is cool oh i didn't actually i oh, neat what looks better than that or this no, no, no i'm gonna use this for the size that's fine it's fine but yeah this is uh this is cool god i love building in this game Seriously, the devs have done such a good job with the um, building in this game. It's just so satisfying what you can do. And if you guys have done satisfying builds before, or you enjoy just building things, 
Or you want to show off some of your builds? Come join the Discord. Then the link is in the description below. There's a bunch of us already in there. Share your build picks with us, you know. Might get some sneak peek into future videos and stuff like that. It's a cool place. So join, come hang out. Yeah, that's hella satisfying. All right, I need to do something for the back. I just don't know what. Do I want it like from there to there? Like, like a wide arch maybe? Yeah, maybe I'd do a wider arch than like what those ones are maybe. Yeah. Like there. Like that, maybe. Is that too wide? Nah. Yeah, that's fine. That's good. Okay. There we go. Now that is the stuff that I need to fill in. Now what I'm thinking for this... Is I want to use these... Newer dividers. That actually... Looks alright actually. I like that look. Yeah, I rate that. I rate that actually. All right, I don't, I don't think I can do, like I can do this, but that just looks rubbish. Maybe I just leave it open. Maybe I just leave that open. Okay, I like those arches. Those arches are pretty neat. Did something destroy my crafting table? Just realize that. Yeah, I like that. That looks really cool, actually. That actually looks really cool. Some of these trim stuff is like just mental. I like this Ashwood stuff as well. Ashwood's cool. Digging Ashwood. Arched wall. Like, man, come on. I really like that corner piece. But I like it better up there than down here. I feel like down here, this, like, it makes more sense for an arch down here. This looks sick. This seriously looks sick. Oh, oh I forgot about the actual lamps. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. All right, yeah, 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 bet, bet, bet. This is cool, it's cool. This looks mad. I really like how this has come out. That's actually come out way better than 
thought it would. Looks delightful. So, all I need to do is put down some stairs and I have an idea. There we go. Obviously, it needs to be like, you know, re... I need more wood. Obviously, it would need to be like parked a little bit differently in here. But I like the ashwood touch. And I, I just need to trim off the edge. So it doesn't look like it's just, you know, free floating. Uh, but I actually like that. That looks nice. Question is... Am I going to be able to fit it? Oh, yeah, I'll be able to fit it on the other sides too, as well, on the other ones as well. Yeah, it's no problem. Uh, I'm going to go and get started on the long boat now. Which will be a... I mean, it's going to be the same thing. It's just going to be bigger. And then the Drakkar is going to be... Bigger. You know what I mean? So. Like, Jakar's one ain't good. Like, not gonna be playing around. This is gonna be massive, this one. I really hope that I can make the roof fit. But God, I'm gonna be so dev. Ah, it's the only one way to find out. So let's, let's cook. All right, so good news. The long boat. Done. Long ship, long boat. Yeah, ah, with the long boat. It's done. Looks nice. Looks cool. Fits in nice with the air calf. Even better news. I got the roof. The Drakkar. It takes it. You have no idea how much of a pain this was. Having to build up scaffolding for each of these poles. But it's actually pretty sturdy. It's 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 not too bad. The only downside, is, so, so, uh, the only downside is because I really wanted to do it with um, the Grousen roof. To, me, to be honest, I would have liked to do it with Grousen completely because it, it it just would would have looked really cool. But I don't think I can build it that high. And the Grousen only seems to have one like angled roof. The other one is like an arched one, so it just doesn't look right. No, it's, I mean, it's fine. I, I, I like the look of this one. Um, but yeah, Drakkar's up with the raven, wolf, dragon. Run over to the other side. Yeah, that looks sick. That looks so cool. It's not finished, obviously. I mean, like, it's still, it's still completely open while the other two have been kind of decorated and filled in on the side, so... I still need to do that, so I'll fill in all the sides and all that kind of stuff, do the little back, make sure that's all pretty. And then I'll finish off with the actual dock section here, because I'm going to do, obviously, the tower, tower, braziers, stuff like that, like, have some stairs, and, you know, just finish off with, like, the general pretty up of everything. But, uh, it's, it's coming along nice. This is, like, taking away... I, I, every time I do one of these builds, I'm like, oh, yeah, like, nah, it'll be quick, it'll be quick. This is taking me, like, hours. It's, it's 4.30 in the morning, so... Yeah, good times. Um, but yeah, given how late it is, I'm going to go get some sleep. But I'll be picking this up again tomorrow to finish this off. So I need to finish this before I start the next build. And the next build will also be a really... All the coming builds are going to be really, really cool. But, but this one's like... I'm just really digging this decoration on the side. Like now that I got all these... Uh, the different woods like it just it looks so much better the divide is just oh just elevates the builds massively and then this will be on that so it's gonna it's gonna look awesome really really elevates these builds all right i'm gonna get some sleep and then we'll finish this again tomorrow so uh you guys will see me in two seconds all right
All right, it is now the next day. Uh, I've set up some scaffolding around the entire Drakkar dock. Is it call it garage. Oh, what do, you, what do you call it? Where like a boat? Ah, oh, whatever. The, the dock. Um, so I've set up some scaffolding so I can just get around up the top and kind of fill it in a bit. Same deal. You know, it's going to look kind of similar-ish to those sides, just you know, scaling it up. And that really. Really? No, 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 you can't run away. Anyway, um, I'm going to get this filled in. Same deal, I'll probably leave like some certain spots that are open. Yeah, I'm like genuinely surprised that this managed to go the whole way up. Thank God. Uh, but yeah, I'll fill all this in going down my trim put some like dark wood trim around the uh what are they called like the stone sections oh actually how do i want to i should actually decide how i want yeah i'll do it that way um i'll do some dark wood trim like i'll use a uh... oh seriously i'll use i'll use these like along the stone and stuff like that Whoa! along the stone and stuff like that. Uh, and then, yeah, it'll, uh, it'll, it'll look good. And then I'll add some little, whoops, towers and stuff like that on either side. And then the actual dock component is done. There'll still be more works that, uh, that will happen here, but that will be for next time. But I'm just going to deal with, uh, this slight, that problem and then get that built. Look, man, we need to, we need, we need to talk about this. All right. You need to stop coming up here and trying to bite my toes. You can't do anything. Like you're just gonna be running. Like you just uh, let me let me help you. Anyway, I'm done. Like, here's the thing. This 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 stuff like looks like to me looks dope. I'm like yeah, it looks sick. Like it looks really cool. But is this like you know like you type in like you know another person like you know like oh like she or he or whatever isn't isn't my type. Is that like the similar thing? Like to me, it looks really good, but to you guys, you're going to be like, nah, it looks like ass. I hope it doesn't, <laughs> but to me, it looks cool. Um, but yeah, I finished the actual decoration side of things. It looks sick being inside though. Like, I don't know. I haven't really seen anyone actually roof out a Drakkar before. Like that looks awesome. Obviously it looked better when lights and all that kind of stuff are, you know, illuminating everywhere, but it looks sick. This little little dock area. And then, you know, out of the uh blackwood trim. Um what I'm gonna do now to basically finish this off, because it's not it's actually it's not that far from finishing, is build up these two little side towers, which are like pilot lights, I guess. Would you call them pilot lights? I don't know. But I'm gonna build them up so I can put the uh, oh. Standing brazier inside each one. They're not going to be like crazy high. Probably like double or triple this, and then I'll do like a nice like arch pattern. Oh, that this this one I might be able to use the Rustin. Oh, okay. But uh, yeah, I'll, I'll do something with these to you know, make them a little bit more elevated just because it's kind of like where the boat's coming in and out. But, uh, I mean, huh? looking pretty cool. Like, it's looking, looking pretty main. I don't know. You know I might be wrong, but I like it. <laughs> but, yeah. Anyway, all right. Well, I'm going to continue this. 
All right, I'm going to continue these, finish these, put in some, I'm going to use, uh, usually I use torches, but I'm really sick of having to fuel up the torches. So this time, oh, ballistas would be pretty cool to put it there. Yeah. Anyway, uh, I'm sick of having to fill up the torches all the time. So what I'm going to do is use, I could use wisp torches, but I'll probably lava in. Um, I'm probably going to opt for the Dvergal wall lanterns and the pole lanterns gonna have to go looking for some more i don't know if i'll have enough i might have enough to be able to kind of like illuminate it a little bit but i'm probably gonna need to go get more i'll make them can i oh i can make them uh and they're not that bad bronze certling core and crystal okay cool i would just i don't need to go get more i can just make them oh <gasps> i forgot banners oh look i'll decorate the whole thing put in some tables and lights and stuff like that but oh, that's been rock but uh yeah not far not far we are close now, considering this has taken a lot longer than I uh, originally anticipated. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to get these towers finished. And as the sun's going down, we are finished. I may have been waiting for the sun to go down, but uh, yeah, it's come along real cool. Lanterns everywhere. I'll probably I might put a couple more like in certain spots just because there are spots where there's no light. You know, these towers that allow uh you know they're, they're kind of like guide lights, I guess you could say. Stared it up so we can just kind of run up pass through either side if we need to go from you know one side of the uh, island to the other we can pass straight through oh, i forgot to delete the forge <laughs> anyway uh everything uh you know we can get under this is being left bare so this part over here is all being left bare because the next one video i think it is it's gonna be will be utilizing the space so this is being left bare for now, but you guys will see in the next video because it's literally like once I finish recording this, I'm going to start that one. But yeah, this looks awesome. I might pop up some banners, but undecided at the moment. These lanterns are so good though, because I don't have to top them up. Like it's just full now take the uh, stairs down to the boats the same on the carve well, the carves one's a bit wider because you know it fits in a little bit easier this is sick this is really cool and it's like I've finally utilized this space that's been here for ages that I haven't ever utilized so it's it's good to It's good to, um, bro's just going for a swim. It's good to finally be utilizing it. it looks cool, man. I'm going to go up to the lighthouse. I want to see, uh, see what it looks like from up there. God, these stairs take forever. Oh, it's random wood. Oh, something must have... Every now and then this roof, the roof on the uh, lighthouse breaks. There's obviously the wood from that. I don't actually know why the wood breaks. Jeez, there is actually quite a few. Roof still there? What? Oh! What? Whoa. Well, that's a plot twist. All right. This is cool. A seg has been dealt with. Let's not talk about that. Maybe that's why the roof keeps getting broken. 
What a random spot for them to spawn. Anyway, hang on. I thought they can't spawn in the meadow. Whatever. Um, harbor is finished. I, just, I mean, this literally is a harbor. I can't really use the word dock. Like, it genuinely is a harbor. But this is, yeah. This is, this is properly cool. I'm going to end the video there because next time we're going to be building like the sweetest uh, smithing like mass production area. So windmill. No, windmill's not uh, not like it's completely pointless or windmill here in the meadows. I'm going to put a windmill anyway. Windmill, every single smelter that I could possibly need, every single refiner that I would need. That's all going to go in that slot behind... Like, like in between the long boat and the Drakkar. And then behind the carve and the long boat here, right next to the actual uh, stone fire pit circle, I have something else planned for there. It's gonna be, a, gonna be, gonna be, it's gonna be a cool one. So that being said, if you haven't, make sure that you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of these future videos. Because there are gonna be some real cool ones coming up. Anyway, smash the thumbs up button, drop a comment down below, but join the Discord. Bunch of us in there. Come share some of your builds, some of your ideas, and just hang out in general. Anyway, thank you very much for hanging around to the very end, and I will catch you in the next one. See you later.